Welcome back to Hollow Knight. We are in the Fungal Waste. We can't head across here to the right because we don't have the um, uh, the wall climb just yet. But I'm going to get that soon. Uh, once we find a little item called the Mantis Claw, uh, I will be able to climb up the walls. But for now, um, we're going to head down to the Mantis Village and take on the Mantis Lords. Oops. Uh, those Mantis uh, Warriors do have uh, quite a long reach there. Uh, they are susceptible uh, from attacks from above. Oh, he still got me there. Okay, let's have a quick look at the map. We need to rest. Uh, is there anything over here? I'm sure I'm missing a few secrets along the way, but uh, hopefully grabbing most of the important things. Well, hopefully grabbing uh, all of the important things. Let's just um, take out... Whoa, take out this little uh, mantis wasp here. I'm not sure what the exact name of it is. But uh, we're working our way down to the mantis village. Once we um, destroy the mantis lords... Uh, these guys will actually become passive. I do have the uh, Thorns of Agony as well, which does one damage to all creatures who are nearby when I take damage. Uh, so that does help out a little bit. We don't have a lot of... Oh, he's still, he's still, he still hits me from above. It's a little bit annoying. Oh, he does have an upward attack. Okay, yeah, there is a bench down here. I can kind of almost float all the way down. I'm um, not really worrying about the wasp. The wasp will actually follow me. But... Uh, let's not worry about them for now. Um, okay, wasn't the best place to, to drop. Just go a little bit slower here. There we go. Whew. So I can rest here, update the map. There's a little bit more to explore over in this direction. Uh, there's a charm which I can pick up down here. There's a little creature that's stuck. I can't really help him at the moment. Um, unfortunately, there's nothing I can do about it. But there is a, a, a dash charm uh, down here. A dash master charm. Uh, now, getting up is a little bit more difficult than uh, than dropping down. And I will have to deal with those mantis wasps along the way. Um, there's a geo over here as well. Oops. So I might as well pick this up while I'm here. I still need the 1800, I think it is, for the... Um, oh gosh, what am I doing? I still need the 1800, I think. Or 1600 for the um, uh, for the lamp. Uh, 
Uh, now there is a geo cluster over here. Maybe worth just trying to pick it up. Oh, they've got such a long reach. Life will get a little bit easier once I have the um, uh, the Mantis Claw upgrade. Okay, so here we are in the uh, the Mantis Village. Uh, the Mantis Claw is not too far away. Let's just drop down. Oh, take out the these little warriors here. Okay, so the Mantis Claw is just down here to the right. I can pick that up. And this is a new ability, really important for getting to a lot of new areas. So we can now do the uh, the wall jump, which is good. So we can climb up walls. We still don't have the double jump. We'll get that quite a bit later. Uh, for now, this is going to have to do. There's a charm up here, I think. Let me just check. Uh, there's one of these little trees, and we'll be using those a little bit later as well, once we get a new ability. Uh, yeah, oh, it's a Wanderer's Journal, so we can sell this um, to a shopkeeper a little bit later. I think that's worth about 200 Geo. So there are different relics that you can pick up um, along the way and sell them. Uh, that's one of them. Um, now that opens a big gate down below, which leads to the area where the Mantis Lords are located. And it also opens that little door there. Let's just pick up this uh, Geo Cluster. I'm just going to drop straight down and we'll get just get straight to this uh, boss fight. Um, okay, spikes. Oops. I'll try not to kill myself along the way. open the uh, little compartments to the left and the right here. Um, I might not bother with that right now. Actually, I need to open this one. Okay, no, I will need to I will need to go down to the left 
and uh, start opening up those ones. Okay, so that's a shortcut back to the beginning of the level there. There's another door here. Another one there. And uh, this will actually take us down to the Mantis Lord, so I'm just going to open up this one first. And okay, this is the, the boss fight. I probably won't give any commentary because it's a little bit tricky. We face one of them first off, and then we face two at a time. Okay, so this is where things get a little bit more difficult here. We are facing two at a time. Oh. Oh. Oh gosh. Oh my god. Yeah, it's tough. No, 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 no. just wasn't in the right position there. If you're right in the middle, oh, you can you can um, heal out there, but just not getting the right spot. Oh god, oh my goodness. Come on, die, someone die, yes, okay. Now it's uh, a lot easier. There we go. So, fairly tough uh, boss battle there. Whew, but we have managed to do it. Okay, the path over here leads to Deep Nest. I'm definitely not going to Deep Nest right now. I'm going to head back up to uh, the Mantis Village and claim my reward. Drop down here. Uh, they're passive now, which is good. I don't need, really need to worry about them. Uh, let's open that. Uh, now, if you go here before you destroy the Mantis Lords, he will flip the switch and close the door so you can't get through. Um, but he's letting us through now, which is good. So let's have a little look around. Uh, we can rest this bench. Fantastic.
found the Mark of Pride there as well. Um, we don't have the double jump at the moment, so I can't get up there, unfortunately. I'll we'll need to remember that for another time, unless we can... Oh, oh gosh. Got another holiness seal there. No, no. Oh, God. <laughs> I thought there may have been something else down here. That's not the right way either. Oh, my goodness. Let's head up back this way. of Geo. Fantastic. Whew, beautiful. Now there's just a couple of things I want to grab before I leave uh, the fungal wastes. Um, so there's a couple of the grubs that I want to rescue. And then I'll open up the uh, the doorway to um, the City of Tears. Oops. Okay, so there is a grub that we can uh, rescue up here. It's a little bit difficult with all of these bouncy mushrooms and things, but... Geo uh, first. Um, so that's the first grub. The next one's a little bit more... Whoa, oh gosh. A little bit more difficult uh, to rescue. Uh, I'm just going to continue across here to the right. Uh, we should be able to access this area now that we have the uh, the wall climb. A little geo cluster here as well.
Oh gosh, just missed it. That's a bit of a shame. All right. Oh gosh, it's a little bit, uh, a little bit tricky uh, getting around here, but uh, a couple of little uh, tricky wall climbs, but uh, that's okay. Right, so we're going to head across. Um, I really don't like this this acid. Um, now down the bottom we have, I think it's a charm. Uh, at the top, I think is, is it a geo we have. It's just oh. Oh no, no, no. <laughs> Alright, heal up and uh, try this again. I think up there is... Is there anything up there? No, I actually don't think there's anything there from what I recall. Okay, um, so that's the grub. Uh, he's been rescued. Oh no 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 no! <laughs> I thought we could. Um, I forgot. This is a little bit uh, tricky here. Ah oh, gosh. And that's a, a half jump, um, and then immediate jump, and then. Oh. Jump across. Okay, there we go. Whew. Uh, so we found the spore shroom. So that is pretty amazing. Let's just heal up a little bit. Um, now I can uh, break open the uh, the shortcut there. Oh. Oh, what on earth am I doing here? After killing the mantis lords. These shrooms are going to kill me. The bouncy shrooms. All right, so we're going to head back to the uh, City of Tears. Um, let's just drop down here. Oh my god. Uh, the jump is not working for me. Uh, let's just use the dash instead. There we go. I actually want to kill a few of these little uh, critters now, just to get my uh, my health back. Or not. That's okay. Um. actually taking a rest at the bench, although um, the game will save once we reach the, uh, the City of Tears. That's not what I wanted to do there. Yeah, we do. Oh, do need to head up here. Okay, back up to full health, which is good. Feeling a little bit more confident. Uh, let's just head across and um, see if we can make our way past the spikes to the, uh, the City of Tears. Uh, this is where we saw Hornet, and uh, she disappeared off there somewhere in the distance. Um, so let's... Oh, I oh, should have jumped off, first of all. Let's try this. Is the bench there? Oh, just not close enough. Let's try this again. There we go. Okay. Uh, so I think that's halfway, halfway there. We can now uh, run across and back again. A bit of a shortcut, which is good. Uh, we still have the uh, second half to go. Uh, 
Ah, we've done it. Beautiful. Fantastic. Okay. Um, so there is a big door here, but uh, there's something that we can place in here. A large knight statue. There is a socket on its chest. Insert the city crest. Yes. This door will open for a short while. Um, did I not choose yes? Oh, there we go. Um, so this door's going to open for a short while, then it's going to close behind us. And we're going to be locked into the City of Tears. So we won't be able to come back this way for... Well, we'll have to find another way back. Um, let's just wait for this door to close. There we go. Door has been closed and we are locked into the City of Tears. So we're going to explore this in the next episode. Thanks for watching. See you all again soon for Hollow Knight.